It started here, and if Maddie Schrader has it her way, it'll end here. On the field, girls by her side. Instead, this time, she's a fan. Uh, we weren't even really aware that anything happens. My ear started ringing. During a late May tournament, Maddie wasn't on the bench. She was in the field. She just made a diving catch. For a girl that once played a tournament with a broken hand, a hard diving catch didn't seem like such a big deal. And then she started crying. I'm like, why are you crying? She goes, I don't know. The game went blurry. Her legs gave out. Within hours, she was here in a hospital bed in a medically induced coma. We had some like? really trying moments, yeah, was... some really horrible moments that you, as a parent, start thinking, did I tell her I loved her enough? What was the last thing I said to her? Do I push her too hard? And it just brought me to tears. At first, Maddie didn't get it. Why was everyone so worried? It took time for her to understand that she'd been gone for hours, days. Here we go, pick it up. That's changing. She's rehabbing, feeling better. Now she can actually attend games. And for the first time. <laughs> <laughs> her team has revealed the new warm-ups. Let's babe? call this Maddie inspired. Our outfield's crazy. You're so Which is why Maddie says it's hard being on the other side of the fence. Here we go. Let's go. Keep it going, Sizzle. I mean, Here we it go. sucks for all the girls, and it does for me, too. My goal is to get back out there. Trader is still improving. In fact, she's taking in the game that you see behind me right now. But she understands that this could have been very different. In fact, the same day that she was hurt, a girl in California playing softball also went down. And that girl later died. Schrader, just 15 years old, made it a point to ask me that she make that she get her word out there that she's praying for her and that she's sending love to that young girl's family right now. Reporting live at Dill Field, I'm Matthew Smith with photographer Nick Bohan, WOWT 6 News. Great to see Maddie with her mm -hmm. teammates, too. Great support. Looks Great like they're having fun tonight. And uh, no set time for Maddie to return to the field. The doctors say the goal is to get her healthy. And she told us when she comes back, she won't stop diving. She'll do what it takes to win.